Introduction to Case Information System 4.0 CIS 4.0 is built on latest technology for scalability and efficient management. Cloud enabled with two-factor authentication. Enhancements to protect sensitive data and ensure role-based strict access. Intra-API server for all integration with ePrisons, land records, MCA, ICJS, and step e-filing and virtual codes. Creation and management of JSONs in NJDG Intra. Facility for masking case information on public interfaces is retained in individual cases, all cases of particular case type and all cases in the establishment. Information such as name of the parties, address, gender, age, email of the parties, business on date, orders and judgments will not be visible on public interfaces once masking is enabled. Caveat details shall be automatically masked when establishment is masked. Business details, details of victims and witnesses, email, mobile, address, license number and alternate address in filing, registration and caveat are now always encrypted. Petitioners, respondent, relation name for filing, registration and caveat are conditionally encrypted. Hidden orders and judgments are stored in separate folder to ensure non-disclosure in any public domain. UID and number and passport number are removed from filing and registration forms. Facility for viewing notifications latest updates is provided in the login page. Dashboard Dashboard facility is completely revamped in CIS 4.0. Dashboard is one of the six tabs that are now available. Dashboard tab displays 14 parameters along with drill down facility. Cause list for selected date can be viewed. E-filed cases are indicated with a link to view details. Pendency data based on five different parameters is displayed. You may choose to view data separately for civil or criminal cases or combine. The data can be viewed in graphical as well as grid format and can be downloaded in SVG or PNG or CSV formats. If particular case type is selected on the panel on the left side, data get populated on the right side panel for that case type under four parameters. Data on disposed cases are presented in this tab and all features available in pending tab are also available here. Additionally, Users can select specific period and populate data for that period. Facility to view pendency statistics based off various delay reasons is provided in this tab. Civil and criminal cases lists are displayed separately. Purpose-wise list of cases listed on the selected date is displayed. Masters, configurations and notifications. JO code field is available as drop down list. Transferred retired checkbox is provided in modify form. Facility to correct verify the bar registration number is provided. Bar registration number format in conformity with e filing 3.0. Active code checkbox added. Advocates government designations can be directly consumed from NJDG. Organization details are available for selection from drop-down list. Facility to select case types dealt in that specific establishment. New establishment type field to enhance analysis and reports is provided. Party, hide, check box provided here in earlier version is removed. If party, hide, was enabled in CIS 3.2, data fields are encrypted by default. Language selection option available for bilingual states in ICJS tab. New tabs for MCA, land records, rural, land records, urban, are provided. Copying, Nazarat move to periphery module. Facility to post notifications is provided. These notifications will appear on login page for all filing and registration module.
Facility to copy previous case data using old case number through a checkbox option is provided. High party option checkbox is provided here and system will prompt for selection of this checkbox if age provided is below 18 years. Personal details of parties such as mobile number, email etc. are always encrypted. Details of court fee paid as input field in case details tab is provided in the filing form. Nature of case as civil or criminal will be based on lower court case type. Link provided for appellate court to view the old case data is provided. All victim and witness data are encrypted. Party UID details are not captured in the registration form. Name and father's name are conditionally encrypted. Email, mobile, address, license number, passport number, alternate address are always encrypted. Proceedings module. Pass over option and hearing status is provided. Change advocate option is provided in court event. Option to enter under trial information is provided under court event for criminal cases. Multiple next dates option is also provided in court event. Committal option and disposal of criminal cases. Select sessions establishment option and disposal of criminal cases. The sessions establishment can receive the case through transfer of case menu. Convicted option and case disposal to enter conviction details for all accused. Convicted form is now also accessible from case proceedings form as a separate tab. Previously entered at section details can be viewed in convicted tab. Highest level of punishment is captured. Prison details are also captured. Court commissioner option added to assign advocate or other officer to a case. Court VC details option added to document VC related information under trial and e-prison integration module. E-prison's API is now integrated with CIS to fetch prisoner ID details. A new form is provided to update the prisoner ID for under trial, pre-trial and convicted cases. List of cases for which prisoner details are available can be accessed for selecting a case. On selecting a case, prisoner details are displayed. When updated, prisoner ID is displayed. Facility to add court event as under trial prisoner is also available in daily proceedings. Details of police station, FIR, and YAR are now displayed in under trial prisoner form. Under trial prisoner report is made exhaustive by combining other reports. In total, nine new fields are added and one removed. Process, orders and judgments module. Now processes can also be generated for unregistered cases and are available in the dropdown for selection. When a case is selected, status of previously published processes can viewed. Latest status can be updated by clicking the refresh button. Status of service in terms of served, unserved or pending is provided. Facility is now provided to download process status report in PDF, Excel or CSV format. Upload icon is now displayed next to process description to indicate completion of process upload. Count of today's uploaded orders is displayed next to case number. Automatic recognition of orders with digital signature is now available. Timestamp of upload of orders is now captured and displayed. New facility is provided to upload orders in bulk for a particular cost list. Case-wise counts of today's orders and uploaded orders are displayed. New facility is provided to download templates in bulk for a cause list. The templates are downloaded in .tar for pre-trial module. Tabs for dashboard, remand, bail and application forms has been introduced. Remand, cause list and remand register and accused custody reports are now available. New radio button to add remand details based on police station or cause list has been added. 
Option to view FIR in PDF format is now available if API is provided by ICJS for the particular state. Facility to capture whether hearing was done over video conferencing has been provided. Selection of multiple parties option has been introduced to enable entering the remand details. If MCR is selected, select prism option appears along with related input fields. The FIR tab has been introduced to verify to the consumed FIR. Local language option is now available for providing address of occurrence. In the register of FIR, the FIR number field is included. Establishment transfer module. Establishment JSON is now mandatory and can be created through NJDG Intra. To create JSON, first update code Establishment Master under administration. The Establishment Master form is now modified to include appellate code details. Create JSON tab is provided to generate JSON. The created JSON can be downloaded. Ensure that the downloaded JSON is copied in SW Accord IS slash DC underscore encode folder. Transfer of a case from one code to another code involves three steps. Step 1 Establishment Transfer A case transfer can be initiated by source establishment by selecting state, district and establishment name of the target establishment from the drop-down list. Step 2 Receive Cases Target establishments can search cases using case number or CNR number. Registration number is generated for the received cases. Step 3 Update transferred case status. Source establishment can view the list of all transferred cases and update corresponding registration number generated by target establishment. Facility to generate report for cases transferred and received has been provided. Facility to transfer multiple cases at once has been provided. List for selection of multiple cases can be generated using five input parameters. Multiple case selection option available here. Admin facilities. New facility to generate audit report is now available. On-demand report can be generated for any CNR. Report captures old and new field values of any modification along with date and time. It is to be noted that user credentials and IP address will get captured only if they are different. Judge leave management is now available as a separate menu item with three forms. Judge leave form to specify leaves. Judge in charge form to assign an interim judge for the duration of leave. Judge joining form to specify joining date of the judge on leave. New forum has been provided to capture legal aid related information. Facility to change advocate name, if required, has been provided. Reports for cases with legal aids can be generated as and when required. Facility to modify data and delete records in victim details and witness information forms has been provided. All the victim and witness information are now encrypted and will not be visible on public platforms. Dynamic Reports Module Facility to generate customized reports is now available. CPC can generate required reports and circulate the SQL file to court users in the state. To generate the SQL file for the customized reports, Access Custom Register Master under Management Reports in NJDG Intra. Input fields indicates list of parameters available for selection which becomes user input fields for preparation of report. Input fields are available to users for report preparation in CIS. Report fields indicates list of parameters available for selection which gets populated as columns in report. Report fields populated as columns in a report generated in CIS. Select required input and report fields. Enter report title and name and submit to generate SQL file that can be downloaded and shared with court users. 
save the SQL file received from CPC user in local machine and use the import facility provided under dynamic reports to make it available in report type drop-down list. Provision is made to display vehicle number in MACP case report generated through Query Builder.